How's everyone doing again? This is Miles Per Hour 88. Just making one more uh, tour slash overview for today. This is the the gaming setup here. So pretty much this setup. There's a 50 inch LG plasma TV. Purchased it uh, several months ago. It was on sale. It was four hundred and ninety nine dollars, I believe. And it does have 1080p capability. The inputs on the back here, let's get these. Your PC inputs, digital audio out, USB input, two HDMI coaxial, that type of deal. Just standard again. All the controls are on the, the bottom here, as opposed to the side or hidden behind it. It's just sitting on its stand. I haven't wall mounted the unit yet. And down here, there's a 250 gigabyte Xbox 360 S. I've had this one here since 2010. It has a Gears of War 3 sticker on it. Put that on last year. Currently has Gears 3 in it right now. Down here on this side, they're a bit backwards. Should be underneath each console. Is the PlayStation 3 games and a few 360 and Xbox. This here is a classic game. Can't beat this one. Conquer Live and Reloaded. It is a really hard to find game, but it's one of the best ones you'll ever play. I also have the N64 version of it, the original. Here there's Ratchet and Clank, Sly, Splinter Cell, Far Cry, Grand Theft Auto. Just your basic games. Don't have anything newer yet. So we got net of games. In the center here, there's a Rogers HD 3800 HD PVR. There's nothing too special about that. I do have a few shows and movies recorded. Just recorded Lord of the Rings the other night. On this side, there's the Xbox games. All the Gears of War, Forza, Halo everything like that. This game here, Splinter Cell, if anyone else plays this game, add me on Xbox Live and we'll play. I used to be really good at this back in 07 when it came out, like just after then, but nobody plays it anymore really. It's a very fun game. Uh, I'd encourage other people to buy it just so they could play with me. You can get it for probably five bucks nowadays. Uh, here's the PlayStation. It's an older, slim model, 120 gig. Again, I've had that since 2010. And down here is the Xbox screen. Currently, I don't have Netflix or anything set up. I stream all the music and videos from my computer. as opposed to Media Center. It's just too much work to set up and it's unreliable. Social. Eh, nothing there. I haven't really played online lately. I just got Xbox Live back again too. Not a whole lot on here. Had me on Xbox Live though. Sergeant Swanky. I think it's the same for the PSN. But otherwise, that's about it for this setup. I do have the Guitar Hero 3 guitar here. Again, it's not something I've played in a while. But it's something else. I keep my controllers up here on this shelf. PS3, I only have one remote for that. 360. That's my other remote that I'm using right now. They pretty much just sit there above the TV. And that's pretty much it for now. I have more consoles, a whole collection of them, but they're put away right now. There's a Wii, modded original Xbox, Dreamcast, all that. 
but for now just downsize to this. Don't really need anything else. If I do any PC gaming that's done on my computer over there. I'd eventually like to hook this desktop up to this TV and use it as a primary monitor. Or if I could come across a VGA cable it's long enough to reach over here. Well, that's pretty much it. Make sure to check back because I'm making more videos again now. Thanks for watching.